Elena, congratulations. You are through to your first ever Australian Open final. You must be very pleased and very proud, not just to be in the final, but with your performance tonight. Yeah, for sure. I'm super happy and proud uh, uh, with my team also. Uh, without them, it wouldn't be difficult to be here. And uh, really, thank you a lot. Because without you, it's, it's really uh, it's incredible atmosphere. And I'm super happy to be in the finals and play one more time here. They looked very nervous tonight, by the way. Did you see that? They were very nervous. <laughs> uh, of course, they were nervous because uh, they want me to perform well. And today it was a bit tougher for me because it was different conditions. Uh, I couldn't play really aggressive tennis. Uh, the ball was not going so much. But uh, I'm happy that in the end I managed to win. And uh, yeah, we, I try my best in the final, of course. Now, I just want to, I just want to ask you, um, the original nine, seven of the original nine are here tonight. And I personally want to thank you for everything that you have done for women in tennis and beyond. And I speak for everyone when I say thank you. How special is it to play in front of these incredible legends here and what they have done for women and for women's tennis to make it a, a leading global sport, but they risked everything, they risked their careers and they gave us a voice. How special was it to play in front of them? Uh, yeah, it was really special and uh, nervous, of course, and uh, I want to say a big thank you from, from the players uh, because uh, it's unbelievable what you've done for, for us, for the, for the new generation, and uh, it means a lot. This is your second Grand Slam final now, uh, especially because it's your second out of the last three Grand Slams. But your first one, you said you were nervous and that you were so nervous that you just wanted the match to be over. <laughs> now, do you go into the final in two days' time in a little bit of a different mindset? What have you learned from your Wimbledon final last year? Uh, for sure, I got a lot of experience from Wimbledon and uh, to be honest, I just want to come on court and really enjoy the moment, enjoy the atmosphere because it's, uh, it's really amazing to play in front of you guys. So thank you so much. And uh, yeah, we see how it's going to go, but uh, for sure I try my best. I, I fight and uh, yeah, hopefully I'm going to win. <laughs> Now, a few more people that might hope that you're going to win um, are perhaps your parents and your sister. Your sister watched you win Wimbledon. She was there for the final. Are they here and are they going to be here for the final or are they going to be watching on TV? Uh, they're actually here and they're here from the beginning, so I'm super happy. It's the first time when uh, everybody here, parents and the sister, so uh, it's really amazing and I'm looking forward for the next match to play in front of everybody and especially my parents. You're winning so much when they are here, they might have to start traveling full time. I guess so, because uh, it was first time for my sister to come uh, at Grand Slam at Wimbledon, so now she's here, and I think for the next uh, Grand Slam for sure I'm going to tell her. <laughs> Well, start booking those tickets for the rest of the year. Elena, it has been a pleasure to watch you. We get to do it again in two days' time. Congratulations. Ladies and gentlemen, Yelena Rybakina.